Good morning everyone. Welcome back to my garden. It's been a lovely week. The sun has been shining, the plants have been growing nicely. In fact, the weather has been so perfect that the sprouts are now fully grown. In fact, I should probably pick them. Oh, what a shame. Most of the sprouts are beautiful, but one of them seems to have gone rotten. Hey, who are you calling rotten? I'm the freshest thing in this garden. You try and put me in the compost bin, I'll pop some peas. See how you like that. Well, this is very unusual. I've never seen anything behave like this in my garden. I suppose the green fly on the cabbage last year was difficult, but... You say you got garden problems, well I feel bad for you, Mum. I got 99 problems, but a cabbage ain't one. This is all very silly. I've never heard of a sprout rapping before. I use my music as an outlet for my feelings. Well, it does sound very angry. Well, well I'm rotten, aren't I? You said it yourself. Psh. Well, I am very sorry about that. I didn't want to hurt your feelings. You don't need to say sorry, Veronica. He's just bad. Yeah, pop him in a compost. He's no good. Why show sympathy for a sprout like that? Oh yeah, come at me bro, huh, huh, come on, come at me. Stop it, all of you. This has reminded me of a story. Jesus told a story about a man who was traveling one day and he got attacked by robbers who took everything from him and left him to die. They put him in the compost. I suppose it was a little bit like that. Anyway, shortly afterwards, a priest walked past. He saw the man on the floor, but he decided not to help. He didn't want to get his hands dirty. Sometime later, a Levite man walked past by, and he also refused to help the poor man. I don't like this story so far. I'm very worried about that poor man. Everyone is being so mean to him. Don't worry, because sometime later, a Samaritan man came past. What's a sand man, Veronica? A Samaritan. The people of Israel, the Jews, they didn't get along with the Samaritans, and the man had been injured was from Israel. However, though they were not friends, the Samaritan man picked the other man up, treated his wounds, and took him to a place to get better, and he even paid for it all. We've been talking a lot about the fruits of the spirit and this reminds me of two of them. We know, we know, it's goodness and kindness. That's right, it really is easy to be good and kind to the people who are nice to us. But if we want to grow our kindness and goodness, we should be kind to the people who aren't nice back. Quit your jibber jabber. What has this got to do with me? Huh? Well, even though you were unkind, I'm still going to help you. I've some very special plant food and some lovely fresh soil. Let's see if we can get you healthy again. Come on, 